Good morning guys and welcome back to the Heritage Recreations YouTube channel. Today we're at Dash Original at Holden Hill where we've got the VL Group A out the back. It's uh, just been finished a few days ago and it's now collection day. I've had a good look over the car. This is for you guys to have a look to tell me what you think. It's gone from a maroon interior into a blue. So very shortly we'll do the walk around of that car. And I think it's probably about time to get that thing a cold start. So uh, we'll do that as well so you guys can hear exactly what the car sounds like when we first give it a fire up. Well, here we are, guys. This is the back entrance lane to Dash Original where we've got the 1986 uh, VL Berliner parked out the back. It's now been transformed into the 1987 Brock VL 05 tribute car. As discussed earlier, this thing came to me with a maroon colored interior, had some VN style speaker grills fitted to the front door and looked quite horrific. We tracked down some photos of Peter's actual 87 Bathurst car and it ran an SL style trim inside the car with a cerulean blue so we managed to track down some genuine cerulean blue trim pieces ben at dash original has managed to repair those plastic pieces so everything in the car is as per new so we've got a new hood lighting new dash new door cards new rear seat new rear parcel shelf and the car has had all the black plastics uh, they've been cleaned up and painted so everything in the car is as new. As you'll notice, we've got, got the red SAS seats. Ben's actually got some material coming in from America to re-trim some cars here. And he's gonna save some of that trim for us as well. So we'll get that done in due course. Um, as we look through, we've actually got a new hood lining. The sun visors all been redone. The rear C panel. So the rear C sections, the plastic trims, they always break. So they've all been repaired and they're all the original ones put back inside the car. So they're all nice and new. The rear parcel shelf has been redone and that's all done in cerulean blue and we can't be even happier than what the car has turned out he's done an absolutely amazing job so in the next couple of days the car will go back down to the crash repair the roof has all been repaired all around the windows where it had a little bit of minor rust that's all been repaired however when he's putting the trims back on he made that little mark just in there and we can see some pitting as well around the windscreen that's all going to be repaired properly uh, that was um, some sikaflex people just rubbed it down then paint over the top of the sikaflex so that will all come out and go back to an original again as well so stay tuned we'll get ben out here shortly to fire the car up as we can see it's got the side exit exhaust and the thing with a cold start sounds pretty mean okay we've managed to track down ben working hard inside the trim shop here I've given him the job of firing the car up so he can listen to the cold start. VL Group A tribute. We thank Ben and the guys at Dash Original for getting this car sorted out for us. And we hope you guys like this episode of Heritage Recreations and we'll be back soon with some more content. Thanks guys.